okay. Uh, back shop Pimpernel kindly uh, delivered this to me uh, today. Open it up to make it a little bit easier. Yeah, nice air yeah, bubbles, protected from the uh, Okay, man. In here, here we go. There's the baby. Tascam US 144 Mark II USB 2 audio MIDI in, uh, interface. Um, I ordered this one simply because I wanted simple 2 in, 2 out. This has 4 in, 4 out, by the way. Uh, in the means of, it also has speed if in and out, which is digital in and out, which is good for the sampling, etc. Transferring the uh, data, but uh, also MIDI in and out, which is handy as well. USB powered, headphone output, which is great because I like to do some of my monitoring stuff on headphones simply to keep the neighbours happy. Okay, box, serial number, that comes bundled with Cubase LE. Bit of a shame I use an Al Alberton or Ableton, I should say Ableton Live I'm using at the moment. Eight it's, uh, more than sufficient for my needs. So system requirements. Windows minimum system requirements, there you go. So anything else above that you don't need to worry about. Configuration system minimum. Blah blah blah. That's in there. Jamina. Oh. Right. <coughs> Baby, yeah. Ah, you go. Free promotion. There you go. Back shop Pimpernel. Very good service. Money back guarantee. Thirty days, etc., etc. Very uh, uh, overnight delivery if you order before ten. And, uh, very good service. I'm very happy with them. Free bit of promotion for you. <laughs> go manual. Uh, DVD or CD, presumably. You can containing the drivers etc a group of manuals presumably in various languages hopefully in English somewhere uh, and Tascam USB cable uh, USB A to B you should know what that is by now guys Ta -ta -ta. there we go there she is there it is Aluminium, quite a weight. There's your inputs, uh, XLR inputs, mic and instruments, guitar inputs at the top, line in headphones input, input level controls, monitor mix control, line out control, phones control, all enable you to adjust the volume etc etc when you're monitoring these are the line in obviously phantom power switch which are uh, handy mic or guitar input selects the inputs obviously mic being mic and guitar being the other two uh, mono stereo presumably mono on off mono sum obviously ok there's your digital USB MIDI in and out line out but unfortunately it's R uh, RCA which is not the end of the world but um, you can that's why I say the digital is always useful if you want to transfer it to another device for recording or mastering etc um, this is for monitoring so it's not the end of the world RCA is ok as long as you have decent cables quarter inch jack inputs or half inch jack inputs it's quite it's quite Quite firm actually, here we go, incorporation, nice and steady. Buttons feel okay. Switches are solid. Okay, well we set it up later. See what it's about. There you go, test scan, blah blah blah. By the way, that's a ink pen. Before you put any silly comments about what's that red thing on you. I tried to cover it up but it didn't work, so there you go, it's in the shot. Live with it. Okay, cheers.